Since 2014, at least 49 people have died while taking selfies. But when selfies aren't busy killing people, they're landing them in jail. A man in Ohio was arrested after posting a selfie video of himself allegedly drinking alcohol while behind the wheel to Facebook. Here we go! Selfies can and have been used as evidence in court. So if you're going to commit a crime, don't take a selfie. Also, just don't commit crimes. The man responsible for a 2014 California wildfire took a selfie video of the incident and showed it to a passing driver. I got fire all me. Oh my gosh. I got fire right there. And now he's with me. The video was used in court and the arsonist was fined $60 million and sentenced to 20 years in prison. A picture may be worth a thousand words, but a video is worth $60 million. Thieves are constantly getting caught taking selfies on stolen devices, thanks to the cloud. Whoever had the stolen iPad used it to take a string of selfies. But because the real owner of the device had remote access to all of its contents, she could see every single photo. This guy took a selfie on a stolen phone and got caught. So did this guy. And this guy. And this lady. And these guys. This is my brother Dylan. This is what we get from a good night's hustle. Selfies have been used in some pretty high profile cases. After the Aurora, Colorado movie theater shooting, a judge allowed selfies on gunman James Holmes's phone to be used as evidence. Football player Aaron Hernandez's Glock selfie was used against him in a bail hearing. And after Rihanna posted a selfie of her holding a slow loris, two men were arrested for providing her with the endangered animal. Our generation likes to document everything and apparently that includes crimes. This Mustang still pushing along out here. That's uh, some selfies being taken there. You can't, you can't miss that opportunity. But that habit's making millennials everywhere look bad, especially amongst older generations who love to see us brought down by our strong sense of selfie. It makes those of us who are technically challenged feel like victors on days like this because the, the very generation that makes fun of us has to pay the price. So next time you feel the urge to snap a picture, just remember, you can't spell self-incriminate without selfie. This is your mic check. <laughs>